So the year 2020 is going to be quite a landmark year, especially because there are just 10 years to go for 2030, which is the, the timeline or the deadline for the Sustainable Development Goals. Uh, we've always believed and it's been strengthened, that belief has been strengthened with a lot of partners that we work with, that energy is just an enabler for reaching those development goals, larger development goals that we have set for health, for livelihood, for education, for the way that we look at skilling, for the way that we look at an inclusive development where people can take part participate as well as take ownership of the way that they, you know, um, uh, develop their own communities. Um, energy is a big enabler which is why you know the year 2020 we're just starting out right now but the year 2020 has to play a significant role and I hope that it does in actually creating those collaborations, creating those partnerships between energy providers, you know innovators in the energy sector who are working more with people who have solid background and solid expertise in actually how to deliver health livelihood and education. They all know energy is a gap but we're not collaborating, we're not talking enough. There's a lot of scope in how we can actually look at delivering health better because we're looking at technology and energy delivery innovations. Um, enough has been done, I think, but it's actually time to uh, scale those partnerships. And I think that is going to be the key. We're not going to scale projects, we're not going to scale particular entities, but we're going to scale partnerships and collaborations. And that will that will be the goal of 2020, especially for Selco Foundation, you know, our larger network of partners as well and hopefully we are able to get more people into this partnership network so yeah that's going to be the aim of 2020 something to look out for